What's up everybody and welcome back to a new video. Today I'm gonna do a nice video with settings. My personal settings, my favorite settings and what do I use. We're gonna go over some things, some things that makes your game have more FPS. We're gonna have uh, parts with stretches. We're gonna have sensitivity and crosshair X if you wanna crosshair. That's option, whatever. So let's get into it. First, we're gonna start out with stretches. Stretches is pretty simple. Probably most of y'all know, but the players who are need, I'm just gonna help them. So, stretches has a lot of shit. Like it matters a lot because your aim could be so bad on native because it's so like not the hollow is so small and shit. It looks so bad. So, the resolution I recommend is 1440 by 1080. But I'm gonna show you a difference before any of that. Uh, this is the difference. It's crazy. Crazy work. It's so big. So, how do you put stretchers in my desk? So, you wanna press the Windows key. Press on that. You can search up settings or just press Windows and the I key. And it will pop the settings up. Go to display. And you will see this display resolution. This is gonna be your native, maybe. And you're gonna change it to this. After change it, you have stretches. Simple enough, in it. So, yeah, that's about it with the stretch resolution. Let's get into sensitivity. Sensitivity is gonna be pretty rough. Because it matters a lot about the player and shit like that. But you can try out mine if you like it. You might like it and you might use it. So, I recommend also, before any of that, put your frame at that maximum. It's gonna use more of your GPU and CPU, and it gives you more FPS. And scroll down... I use 1.1. And, unfortunately, I have a custom, like, DPI. It's, I think, I'll just show you right now, look. Going to the Logitech. I have a Logitech mouse, so depends if you have Race, if you have Steel Series, or whatever. So yeah, go in the. I have this. This is my mouse. This I use. I'm click on it. This is my DPI. 1100 by 50. This is gonna be it. I found it like it's perfect ratio. So yeah, that's my sensitivity, guys. I hope you like it. So now I'm gonna show you block strap. Well, block strap is a little bit interesting because you have to have like a bad PC, I guess, to use it. But it's not in all cases. It's actually quite good for every PC. So this is block strap right here. So how to get it? You go into Google. You search up here, block strap. And don't download this. Don't download it right there. Go into GitHub. Scroll down. Uh, and here. Latest list of Blockstrap. This is what you want to install. I'll leave the, lift, uh, the link below. Just keep this link. And just follow my steps. Go down here. Install this. Right here. And after you install it, you know, make the setup, everything like that. And after you make the setup, go on to block strap. You want to go to configure settings. Go to the engine settings. Put this at one. Copy mine if you want to. I don't know. Just look through them. Texture quality lowest. And now we're gonna get into the fast flag. After you copy all of these, we want fast flags. Fast flags, I'm just gonna put them in down below. So what you do for fast flags, add new import JSON, and you're gonna copy paste every the fast flags I'm gonna put in the description. It's simple. And after you do that, you press uh, save down here. Press save. 
then relaunch your block strap and you should have uh, fast flags so now guys we're gonna get into the cross helix cross helix is gonna be a bit tricky because it's something a bit different so let's get into the crosshair the cross is gonna be a little bit tricky so i'm gonna give you this winrar file and you're gonna install it then you're gonna extract it all make a new folder for it whatever you want doesn't matter you press on it and extract all and it's gonna say this you choose your preferred driver and shit or ssd whatever you have and after you extract it you want to download it and you download it it's gonna be like a folder and you have it here click on it it's gonna pop up you have your favorite streamers crosshairs and yeah that's about it with the crosshair and that's about it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it